Hey everyone, it's Lindsay Phillips, Certified Holistic Health Coach and proud owner of TheBestVersionOfYou.com. I'm enjoying a beautiful day in Eastern North Carolina. I hope you are as well, wherever you are. And I'm gearing up for an awesome holiday weekend. It's Labor Day, it's the last hurrah of summer, and it's my oldest son's eighth birthday and my parents are coming in town. So I have a weekend full of fun and activity and beautiful weather. So I just wanted to pop in and give you a few of my quick tips on how we as a family make our long weekends healthy holiday weekends. So when we're grilling out, like many of us do on the weekends, especially for things like Labor Day and Memorial Day and July 4th, um, you know, our, our temptation is to grill a lot of heavy meat. And in order to cut down on saturated fat and calories, you can opt for some leaner protein sources, maybe some fish, maybe some ground bison and make your burgers that way, um, some chicken breast instead of the steak. And while you're at it, throw on some veggies. Make a veggie kebab and grill that up. Or how about some grilled peaches? Peaches are delicious around here right now. And it only takes a few minutes on each side on the grill and you have a delicious sweet treat for after your burger or your chicken. Um, instead of your traditional chips and dip, opt for some raw veggies and hummus or make a dip with some Greek yogurt and some seasoning and um, enjoy your raw veggies that way. Cuts down on a lot of cholesterol and you get some great servings of vegetables and the kids usually love it that way. Make family fun, um, fa family fitness fun for the weekend, you know, so we're going to be taking a family jog, we might go to the beach and have a walk on the beach, you can take a hike, um, play a neighborhood baseball game, do a water balloon fight with your family and run around the yard. There's lots of ways to implement some, some great fitness for your family. Um, in addition, there's a lot of organized races, so, you, so if you are a runner, you might want to check that out as a family activity for you. Another tip is to stay hydrated. It's so important, especially when we're out in the sun, but it also helps to curb our cravings and it keeps us fuller longer and it really keeps our energy up and helps with digestion. You want to get as much rest as possible. Holidays are supposed to be for rest, but a lot of times we end up staying up way too late. And especially for us mamas whose kids have already gone back to school, you want to maintain a normal sleep routine as much as possible. You don't want your kids to be sleeping late in the morning and staying up late and then you have to readjust all over again come Tuesday morning for that back to school time. So you want to keep your schedule as normal and as consistent as possible. Um, if you're going to a potluck, this is a great time to show off your cooking skills and your new healthy lifestyle and inspire some others to join with you. So, so think about your favorite barbecue recipes and, and try and figure out how you can rehab those and make them healthier. And if you need some help, I'd be more than happy to help you. Just shoot me a message and we can rehab them together. But there's tons of healthy recipes on my blog, on my Facebook page, and on my Pinterest page. So make sure you check those out. As well as the healthy um, meal plans that you should be receiving every Friday afternoon. So those are just a few of my healthy tips. Um, I hope you have a great Labor Day weekend and enjoy the beautiful weather and the time with your family. And remember, it's about filling up your soul, not just your stomach. You want to fill your soul with great family time, great conversation, um, some rest, some things that you enjoy. And then you'll end up craving those foods and emotionally eating a whole lot less. So have a great Labor Day. I'll talk to you later.